Welcome, welcome, welcome. Alrighty, so let's see what's happening. Um, Pisces, um, there's a situation that is affecting your um, married life and it has to do with kids, okay? Your love life is being affected by kids and I see you're feeling alone, whatever is happening and transpire you, Pisces, or feeling alone. Um, you know, whatever is transpiring, I recognize that, hey, it is what it is, okay? I see a lot of you have secrets of fear, Pisces. Pisces! <laughs> a lot of you, Pisces, have some sort of a secret of fear. Um, and whoever you're having the secret affair is, it feels good. I see that you have been seeing this person regularly, okay? And, um, this has just started and whatever the secret affair is and whatever is that is happening and transpiring, you can see that this situation, you know, you feel good. So whether you're still in love on the side, whatever is happening, you feel good. I see some sort of a love is going to be offered um, to a lot of you. And a lot of you are recognizing and, uh, you know, you feel some of you, um, Pisces, whoever is having an affair, uh, it's going to be coming out. OK, some of you are having some sort of a secret affair with a cancer. It's going to be coming out. Um, and then we see the energy of the Ten of Wands. And the Ten of Wands energy is about recognizing and seeing the truth about our partner. So I see some sort of information about some sort of a secrecy um, that could be coming out about a partner for some of you. Because this is in the foundation of your reading. So some sort of a secrecy over your partner is going to be coming out. If your partner is a cancer, I see that this person have some sort of a secret that is going to be coming out. Some of you could be secretly in love or secretly having some sort of a relationship or affair with a cancer. A whole lot of you is going to be, every time you're going to see a person, you know, I, I I don't know. I, I you know, it's a question that I've always wanted to ask. Um, you know, if you are having an affair with someone, okay, you guys are having an affair. Why don't you get out of the relation you're in? What what is keeping you in the relationship that you're in? And yeah, you know, a lot of people are going to be saying, what a question. Because we get up fair. Because a fair can be happy. Yeah, but when you're caught, you're caught. And that's it. So you go, you can lose like everything that you have. Because it's called an affair. <laughs> Meaning that you are not together. And I don't think it is the time that you spend together. And, you know, that's the thing about it, ladies and gentlemen. Life is just full of surprises. So life is full of surprises and people are going to be re recognizing and finding out the truth and see the truth of uh, things that is happening and transpiring and recognizing, um, you know, the play. A lot of you Pisces are players. Men or women, you are players. All right, you are players because, uh, you know, and I, I think because you're the energy of the lovers, you love like you don't love before. A lot of you Pisces always want to be in love. And this is why you cheat. I think more Pisces cheat than any other sign. And it's okay because you have so much love that you want to share and give. And I see, you know, like the cancer um, um, that cheats. And, uh, you know, all water sign it cheats. And it's because you you have so much love to give. Some of you, um, you know, and, I, you know, what I don't understand is the mundane of this planet that you have to have one person. That is another um, question is you have to be with one person. If you spend the rest of your life with one person. And this is the reason why people cheat, you know, and um I would say if you feel as if 
you have to cheat, then, you know, Pisces, open relationship is good for you, Pisces, because you, Pisces, want to be in love all the time. And open relationship is the best thing for you. And, and, and that is what you need to recognize. So, you know, a whole lot of people like to cheat. A whole lot of people cheat because you have so much love and you want to share it. So when a Pisces cheat, I can understand because, you know, it's because of you're vibrated with love. Even though you're from the, the planet Neptune rules you, um, somehow your art chakra is connected to Venus. Everyone art chakra is connected to Venus. But this is why a whole lot of Pisces cheat because they recognize that, you know, they get bored sometimes. Um, they're always looking for the rush and the genuine of some sort of um, a relationship that brings them, um, you know, you know, as, as if they're always in love. Um, I don't know. <laughs> so um, what we see here is that I see you Pisces men are romancing someone. Ooh, up and down till you say, oh yeah, let me play. So Pisces, there is a lot that is happening here. <laughs> um, a lot is happening. There is no question about this. Just a lot is happening. Whatever is happening and transpiring, um, a lot is really happening um where burdens are going to be over a lot of you where that was having a, an affair it, it this affair is going to be turning into love hmm. okay i see a lot of you are dealing with the sagittarian uh the cancers a lot of secrets coming out about the cancers uh, um some of you by, might be falling in love with the cancers but the scans there have a lot of secrets. <laughs> then we see the energy of the moon, and the energy of the moon has um, also secrets. So secret affairs. A lot of you cancer men are having an affair. A lot of you cancer men definitely are having affairs. Okay, some secrets is coming out about Leo. Um, and some of you Pisces men that was having an affair with a Leo, it is all coming out now. Your wife, your partner, other women are going to be recognizing that you were having a long-standing affair with a Leo, a younger Leo woman. It's all coming out. And I see um, a, a Cancer is the one that is going to be Shedding light and telling your wife about the affair that you have been seeing, that you have been having. So it is a cancer woman who is going to be uh, speaking and letting people know that you and your, that you and this Leah had a secret affair going on for quite some time. Whoever this cancer woman is, this cancer woman is now recognizing the Oriba play that you created is as if um, confusion with some sort of a money or situation. Um, they're going to be recognizing, a lot of you who are in a relationship with a Sagittarian is going to be recognizing something about the Sagittarian and recognizing that uh, the Sagittarian have been offering their love to someone else. So, and I see a lot of you are not going to be pleased or happy, but it is what it is. All right. The burdens are going to be over as uh, some of you were having with a, 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 a cancer. Um, a lot of you, a cancer... They're, they're finding out a whole lot of secrets about this cancer. And, you know, whoever this cancer is that has created a whole lot of issue for a lot of you, whether you were in, you were in this um, relationship with a cancer, whether you were, um, you know, um, 
in a marriage with a cancer they're going to be a whole lot of secrets some you know they're going to be recognizing and finding out a whole lot of secret about the cancer this cancer had a lot in their closet a lot some of it is not good and um people who have a relationship with cancers i see that they're going to be recognizing what this cancer have done people are going to be starting to investigate this cancer and it's going to be recognizing what this cancer have done and the secret that this cancer all a lot of people are going to be recognizing that this cancer had some sort of a secret affair you know so they could be married but they're having secret affair they go away for the weekend they are um, you know, had the house for the weekend and they go away for the weekend and um, people are going to be recognizing that this cancer have multiple and is seeing multiple people and have been seeing multiple people. Um, yeah, the secret affair between you Pisces and, uh, and there could be, um, you know, threesomes, that sort of a thing. Some of you Pisces, uh, go to clubs, that sort of a thing. It is, it is coming up, you know, partner. Um, you know, it is coming up that you Pisces have been hot, uh, going to these places, going over to these places and doing a whole lot of, uh, um, undesirable situation. And they're going to be recognizing who these people are. So, yeah, a whole lot of information is going to be coming out. So brace yourself for this. So, um, a lot of you have a secret admirer. Yep. Oh, a lot of you have some sort of a secret admirer. A whole lot of you have a secret admirer. You are going to be finding out this in um this month that you have a secret admirer so you know expect the unexpected on valentine's day some package could be you know sent to you and you're going to be recognizing that you have a secret admirer okay so um a wonderful wonderful situation is uh, where you know pisces you're going to be recognizing how um beautiful the world is and you know a lot of you men are going to be thinking i don't know what tomorrow brings so i'm gonna have all my fun now but you know having your fun but you know remember if you're in a relationship with a partner or someone else having your fun is good but remember how it's going to be affecting other people i gotta go show your love by thumbs up it's going to be a good month there is nothing to worry about um, no matter what is happening, it's going to be a good month. You are the energies of the lovers. So, um, you know, you love more than anyone else, Pisces. But I got to go. Follow us to the other side. If not, um, show your love by thumbs up. Namaste.